This is a ship, a car carrier coming into the Port of Corpus Christi. We're on North Beach. And you can see how the bay is really calm this morning. It's an offshore wind and hardly any waves coming in at all. So the water is already drawing out. You can see how now there's this smooth part of sand that wasn't there before. And that's what happens. First the water goes out, the bay goes out, and then it starts to come in. And let's see, we haven't gotten our first wake yet, but it's on the way. Here it comes. So these are wakes from the ship. And it looks like, you know, the Gulf of Mexico all of a sudden instead of Corpus Christi Bay. I'm having to back up. You can see how it's... What happens is these wakes come in and they really erode the beach. They pick up the sand and move it. And this is an artificial beach that is, you know, nourished. Oh my gosh, look at this. That is nourished every uh, few years by the state and the city and this year having to be nourished uh, by FEMA it's very expensive millions of dollars to bring this sand in and so these ships that go into the port of Corpus Christi you know for our commerce here our industry are causing these huge problems with our beach and it's eroding down there especially by the Lexington and so what we're proposing is to have breakwaters rocky breakwaters that are coming off the Lexington and going parallel to shore here to stop these wakes along with any kind of uh, hurricane event that would come and also create waves and just to protect our shoreline. So remember that just a few moments ago this was a placid calm morning this is all, this is not wind driven or anything. This is purely wake from a ship going into the port.